Alright, since uh, I got Windows 95 installed, I'm going to go ahead and show you how it boots. Okay, before I get started onto the video, this computer will not be able to ha have sound because somehow it doesn't like the sound driver on here. But I ain't going to really worry about it. I'm going to show you how it boots up on here, how it runs. That's all that matters. But I got all the other drivers installed. There's like a few drivers that it doesn't like on this on this computer. And it's running at 256 megabytes of RAM and at 800 megahertz Pentium 3. That was pretty quick because there's nothing installed and I'm using a 2 gigabyte hard drive. And as you see you got MSN and the online services which is like those which is for dial up that don't even work anymore AOL like 3.0 AT&T WorldNet CompuServe another CompuServe ad I do have some games installed like Solitaire this is the original Windows 95 installation you got Internet Explorer 3.0, Internet Mail, Internet News, Microsoft Net Meeting, good old MS DOS prompt. There's all the original games I have installed. This is Active Movie. That's Windows Media Player, some generic media player. This is one of my favorite ver media player that I used to use on Windows all the time. Even though there ain't gonna be no sound, I'll show you how the interface looks. I like that media. I remember you seeing that media player back in like 1998 on the original Windows 98. That was like one of the best media players. So I was just letting you know that this is Windows 95. I got it installed on the ThinkPad. Okay, I'm gonna try and see. It's having a conflict with that driver show you the sound drive of what it has I tried everything I could to get it to work but it ain't worth it so yeah but at least that ain't gonna really worry about it at least I'm showing you it's running without a problem it's pretty snappy with a lot of RAM and with that 800 megahertz Pentium 4 and there's another good program I used to like it's called CD player that was a classic so I'm going to go ahead and um, end the video and talk to you guys later. Just let me know what y'all think on how Windows 95 boots and shuts down. And see you guys later.